good day fellow sketch uppers today i'm going to show you how to create a super simple half sphere using sketchup first let's start with a circle and let's set it down and then make sure we're touching the green axis and i want my sphere to be 30 millimeters so i'm going to type 15 millimeters and press enter so it's the exact size notice it's tiny so i'm going to click the view tool and i'm going to click zoom to extents. I'm going to use orbit and I'm going to look at the green axis so I've got a little bit of perspective. Notice you can grab and adjust that and I'm going to go back to my circle making sure that it shows that I'm at the origin and I can see the green axis. I'm going to stretch out along the red and I'm going to type 15 so it's the exact same size. It's real important that you've got these endpoints that connect for the next part for your piece to be a solid. I'm going to switch to the line tool and I'm going to go from the origin to the top. I'm going to tap escape and I'm going to go from the red endpoint to the origin. Now when I erase this outside it leaves me the wedge in my circle or my quarter circle. I'm going to switch to the super nifty follow me tool and I'm just gonna follow the outside of my shape to make that lovely half sphere. I want the white face on the outside, so I'm gonna click on it and do reverse faces. I'm gonna click on the pencil tool and I'm gonna connect the two sides. Erase to get rid of that bottom line, grab everything, and then this is the moment of truth when you create a group make sure that it really is a solid. If you've got a volume, then you created a workable half sphere. Make sure you save your cool item. I'm gonna name mine half sphere. So that way I can look back at it at any time if I need to remember how I did it. If you wanna see it from the inside, you can hit your view in your x-ray and you can see all the cool pieces to make sure it's one piece. Thanks for watching. If you get a chance, please click that like button. If you want to see more of my movies, you can hit subscribe. And if you want to be the first to know, please click that little notification bell. Have a great day, SketchUppers.